Hey there! Today I have an outfit of the day video for you. So this is something kind of different for me because usually I just stick to hauls and unboxings but some of you have requested that I do an outfit of the day video so I thought I'd give it a try. So actually I've tried to film several over the last month or so and kind of failed but I think this one hopefully looks okay. Also, I'm trying to do it a little different. We'll try to do outfit of the day using the Cladwell app. So if you haven't heard of the Cladwell app, um, you can get it on the App Store. So I've actually had this app for you know, quite a while. I would say like nine months or so. And um, previously you had to pay a subscription. So I paid for like the annual subscription. But just recently, I think they've made it free and that's for a limited time only. So I'll put some information down below. And this is, by the way, not sponsored at all <laughs> in the description box. But I tried it initially and I kind of abandoned it. One thing I didn't like about it was it was hard to like have pictures of your own clothes. And you know, like they, they basically have stock pictures of types of clothes, but it's not an, exactly what you have. But recently, I don't know if any of you have noticed, um, Stitch Fix now has um, items. So you can actually see pictures of all of the items that you've purchased in the past and you can actually export those pictures. So that's what I've done. And I've exported them off Stitch Fix site and then imported it into my Cladwell app. So I think that is, you know, pretty cool where I can do that. And then I've also been able to, you know, take screenshots of other items that I've purchased. Like, like for example, here's like a Stitch Fix dress and a pair of shoes that I got from Nordstrom. And so I just pull it off the site, do, do like a, you use a snipping tool and um, save it as like a picture. And then I can import it into this app. So then I actually have an inventory of my actual clothes. So that's kind of nice. I mean, not everything, but a lot of my actual items are, are in here, which I think is, is pretty cool. So I actually have been kind of happy with this app and I just used it this past week to plan out my outfits. They'll actually suggest some outfits. So there'll be like three outfits that they'll suggest. Or you can just build your own outfit, which is what I ended up doing. For me, some of the items, you know, like what they would pair didn't exactly look like what I would want to wear. Yeah, but anyway. Okay, sorry for the long ramble. Actually, if you're interested in the Cladwell app, like I said, I'll put some information down below. I, I kind of like it. I, I think I'm gonna continue to use it. I probably won't use it to plan every single outfit because I don't have all my clothes in here. Obviously, I think that would be kind of unrealistic, but I think it is kind of helpful and it's kind of cool. And so for each of the days, I'll put in the little Cladwell outfit picture so you can see, you know, planned and then actual. And also what I'll try to do is if any of the items that I'm wearing in any of my days are linkable, I'll put links down below too. <laughs> but anyway, let's go on with the outfit of the day. Okay, so <laughs> good morning, it's Monday and I'm gonna attempt to do outfit of the day. So here's my outfit of the day. Hopefully you can see it all. Just a white button front shirt and this is um, an Anne Klein shirt that I got from TJ Maxx. And also these are pixie pants. They're plaid pixie pants from Old Navy. And I have, I'm wearing these. It's the first time I ever wearing these shoes and I own them for a year and they're from Dansko. But yeah, here's my outfit of the day Monday. And I had also wanted to um, add on this cardigan and I just got this from my last Stitch Fix and it's the burgundy cardigan that I um, had requested and I thought in case I get cold, <laughs> I'd bring it to work with me. So here is my outfit of the day for Monday and um, yeah, I started a new job so I just realized ordinarily I'd be like rushing out, I'd have to have left by now, but since my new job is a lot closer to where I live, I have more time in the morning, so that's nice. Okay, so that's Monday. Okay, now it's Tuesday, so second day of the week, and actually I'm off today. It's election day, so I'm gonna go vote, and then I'm gonna go with my friend, and we're gonna go see the Bohemian Rhapsody movie, so yay. And we might also go to um, Ross, Dress for Less. So anyway, so this is my Tuesday outfit, and it's very casual. I have my um, pineapple t-shirt that I got from Stitch Fix and I actually really love this. I've got some Vigos olive pants or I don't know what you call these, cargo pants. And these I got from Nordstrom Rack and I also have this denim shirt and this is from Universal Thread from Target. And so this is outfit of the day, um, Tuesday. 
Okay, so here is outfit of the day for Wednesday. So I'm wearing the um, striped dress. It's a sweater dress that I got from Golden Toad last month, I guess. And yeah, so <laughs> just very simple, throw it on. And I have it paired with these pink shoes. These are the Tom's shoes. I had it in a haul. And I don't know if there's, I don't think there's any pink in this dress, but I just like these shoes. <laughs> I think it looks okay. And the Stellan dot necklace. So yes, very simple. This is my outfit for Wednesday, hump day. And I'm gonna go to work. Okay, so here is outfit of the day for Thursday. And just very basic again. <laughs> I've got, this is a top from that I got from Stitch Fix. I can't remember what brand it was. I'll try to put it in something. And I've got these white skinnies from Liverpool that I got from a mix and match box. And I really do love these and I wear them a lot, actually. These are probably my wor most worn jeans. Oh, and I have my, these are these Monroe shoes that I probably had for at least two years. And oh, for necklace, I've got, um, this is a brand new necklace. So I got this from J. Crew Factory. And I do, really do like it. I've been looking for uh, a tassel necklace for a long time. I have another one I got, I think, from Nordstrom This one has these beads, so I thought it was really cute. So I'm going to do, eventually I'm planning to do some jewelry haul. <laughs> I haven't got to it yet, but I'll, I'll try to put something together. And yeah, so that's outfit of the day for Thursday. And oh, also, just stud earrings. I always wear stud earrings. And these are um, Kate Spade. <laughs> okay, that's it. Okay, so today is Friday otherwise known as fry yay <laughs> yeah um, anyway so this is my outfit for today I have um, very casual even though actually I could go casual every day <laughs> but I'm just used to having casual Friday so I'm wearing my uh, Spanx jeggings which I got from Trendsend and also this is a, a top that I got from Stitch Fix about a year ago so I totally forgotten about this top I've probably only worn it a few times and probably not for the last six months but it's just a cute top and um, I was going through my stitch fix items I transferred them all over to that Cladwell app so I saw this in the app I thought hey I haven't worn this for a while so I dug it up from my closet it had not seen the light of day for a while but yes <laughs> that's the one good thing about this Cladwell app so yeah it has this crisscross design which I don't know if it's really in style that much anymore but hey whatever I'm gonna wear it so here we go, outfit of the day for Friday. So this will be the last one for this video. Okay, so that was my first outfit of the day for this week video. So I just did the five days of the work week. I didn't do the weekend. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up so I know. And let me know also if you want to see more of these type of videos in the future. I do have some uh, videos plan I've kind of gotten behind and I do take a long time actually to film and to edit I'm yeah I'm pretty slow sorry but I, I'm planning to do a other Walmart haul and I've actually gotten some really good items I was just wanting to test out the Ellen DeGeneres line and she has like a lot of jeans and stuff so I bought like all the different styles of jeans and they're, all I can say is they're pretty amazing. I, I was I was shocked. But anyway, I'm going to have a, a Walmart haul. And I'm also going to have a Ross Dress for Less haul. So on Tuesday, the day I was off, um, which was election day, my friend and I hit Ross Dress for Less. I hadn't gone there for a while, but I found a ton of stuff. And basically, I just, you know, just bought a bunch of stuff, took it home to try on, and I was amazed. Everything looked nice. So now I have to decide what I want to keep because... I have a problem with a very busting out closet, so I, I can't keep everything. But anyway, so that's coming. Oh, and I've got also a um, fashion. I had been holding off and I didn't think I was going to try fashion, but recently I've seen a bunch of other YouTubers doing fashion unboxings and they've been getting some really good stuff at good prices. So I thought, hmm, I, I, I don't want to be missing out on anything, so I better give it a try. So that's coming. I don't know when, because I know, I, I think your first box does take a little longer. So I ordered it about a week and a half ago and hope to get it soon and I will definitely be bringing you a video for that too. So if you're interested in those type of videos, please consider subscribing so you won't miss out on any future videos. And, um, and that's, <laughs> but that's all I have for today. Thanks again and I'll see you next time. Bye now.